Hey, welcome to the Ranger Rob channel with Rob and Sherry. This video is made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags, available on Amazon right now. Hi guys, this is Ranger Rob and welcome to Central Oregon Living. You know, uh, I always like to talk to you guys about uh, being a little prepared, trying to have three to six months worth of food and, and uh, extras around the house in case you know, uh, we have some problems with food or if you have a storm or uh, electric goes out um, or something even worse. And uh, it doesn't hurt to be a little prepared. And so uh, the next clip after this, I'm going to invade the kitchen because we just went to Costco. And I got to admit, uh, Central Oregon, Bend, or Bend Oregon's Costco was awesome because I just came up from Phoenix, as you know, and the Costco's up there uh, are, I don't feel it was as well stocked as the one we just saw. I was kind of expecting a disappointment. I got just the opposite. Our Costco here in Bend, Oregon was amazing and they had everything we wanted and they weren't low on certain meats or anything. We're down in Phoenix. Sometimes there was hardly any chicken or hardly any uh, steaks. And uh, so anyway, I was very impressed and we bought a lot of meat. And I'm going to show you in a minute in the kitchen and just a little bit of a sample of how we buy meat and how we plan it out. And immediately uh, we buy bulk. We uh, separate the meat, the fit, Sherry and me. And uh, uh, anyway, so we're going to sneak in the kitchen and uh, Sherry hates it when I do that. So let's hop in the kitchen. We'll see what's going on and uh, uh, we'll call it, you know, call it a day after that. So here we go. Well, guys, I'm sneaking in the kitchen for a minute. My wife hates it when I do this tour. But I want to tell you, we went to Costco and we're kind of just going to show you a few things that are great ideas for kind of stocking up the freezer. So uh, this package right here is all uh, pork chops. And what we do is we put them in little packets of two for dinners. And uh, this will feed us for a long time. Then we also bought, these are New York steaks, right? Yeah. And uh, so Sherry and I, <laughs> they're really, really thick. I don't know if you can see that. I mean, that's like over an inch. Anyway, so when we cook it, one steak like this, we split them in half, huh? And then uh, that's one meal. So that's four meals right there for us. So that's from Costco. And uh, I guess the big thing I like to point out is utilize your freezer. Um, another thing that works really good is if you're making soups and things like that, I buy the rosary chicken. Rotisserie. Rotisserie chicken. <laughs> that's, why I, that's why I'm married. Anyway, uh, and uh, we break this up into about three packets. So if you're making chicken noodle soup or anything like this, this stuff is yummy, super yummy. And a good way to uh, not have to waste chicken or cook breasts of chicken and break them up when you already can get it this way. We also uh, do a lot of muffins. We freeze them. Uh, we've got some peaches. Um, those are just good. <laughs> but anyway, we're just kind of pointing out that uh, um, one of the things that's just really important is we don't know what the future is going to bring. And I know it's a little dark in here. But uh, another thing we just did was bought cases of mushrooms. And uh, these little guys right here, um, so much more practical than buying fresh. I mean, obviously fresh mushrooms are delicious. But hey, when you need something to add to rice or to a stir fry and you want mushrooms, this is a great way to go. And this is all Costco stuff. So uh, it's only, it's not a panic. It's not a, uh, one is you can save money when you buy quantity, obviously. Uh, two, utilize your freezer. Um, find ways to take bulk food and break it up into a family. So now we got, it's like almost a month's worth of food now, don't we? <laughs> so anyway, oh, and, we, and, and of course, we utilize our food processor, which is right here. It's a vacuum sealer. A vacuum sealer. We've had it forever. And uh, you can get big kits for them or, uh, at Costco. And we've been using the same kit for a long time, haven't we? 
so the bags the bags that come with it and uh <laughs> she's <laughs> it's a, look at the size of these steaks man that's over an inch so anyway just a recommendation um who knows what the winners bring if you nothing happens um it should be uh just fine but i gotta tell you one thing in central oregon we went to the uh costco in bend oregon and it was amazing they were stocked up really well so uh i never i mean toilet paper and paper towels there it was on the walls it was so much so anyway guys <laughs> i gotta get out of the way but uh just a recommendation stock up a little bit and uh if nothing happens, well, you saved a little money and uh, you don't have to go to Costco so often. Uh, buy bulk and then break it up and, uh, you know, spend the afternoon. My wife's been really good about separating the meat and uh, we're going to eat on this stuff for a long time. So I hope that's a good idea for you and uh, uh, get, get prepared a little bit. Don't go overboard, but just in case we get a little surprise, uh, the shortages are kind of talking about can shortages and we're really going to feel the pain when we get into the fall and winter and um, if nothing happens no harm done so anyway guys talk to you later thank you very much for watching our video please take the time to like subscribe and share our videos all over the whole wide world thanks